listen to this footage of uh, Pierre Polyev explaining in Walter Trudeau is a pathological liar to a journalist that doesn't understand that when Justin Trudeau's lips are moving, he's, he's lying. You've accused the Prime Minister of lying uh, about having information that members of your party are complicit or otherwise involved yeah. in foreign interference. I wondered if you could flesh that out a bit. How do you know he's lying? We and how do you know Justin Trudeau is lying? It's because his lips are moving. We told him to release the names. And we know he'd release the names if he had them. This is a Prime Minister who releases information on foreign interference whenever it suits his political purposes. He names names when it serves his purposes. And so we said, uh, we've got nothing to hide. So name the names, Mr. Trudeau. If you've got nothing to hide, then come out, tell us who they are so that all Canadians can hold them to account. And he hasn't done that because I think the reality is that it's the Liberals who are compromised. We know that Trudeau was aware that in two subsequent elections, Beijing interfered to help him win. Uh, he had that information on his desk. He did nothing with it. He knew he had MPs in his caucus that were compromised. He didn't do anything about that until he was caught. Um, so we can't trust anything Justin Trudeau says on foreign interference or anything else. And frankly, this is a man who has a track record of lying about basically everything. He lied when he said he didn't interfere and pressure Jody Wilson-Raybould on uh, re removing charges for SNC-Lavalin. He lied when he said the carbon tax would be capped at 11 cents a litre. Now we know it's going up to 61 cents a litre. Um, he lied when he said his deficit would never go above $10 billion. Uh, he lies more than he tells the truth, and he's lying in this case as well. Pierre told him directly to Justin, he said, name the names. Just name the names if you know of any MPs. You're telling me that if Trudeau had the names of 11 MPs that are involved in the election interference in, in the Conservative Party, he wouldn't get them like banned from, from, you know, from politics? The moment you know the names of people are, that are involved in election interference, you get them out of the parties. Where, where, wherever and whatever party they're involved with, you kick them out of government. If without willingly or unwillingly involved, you kick them out of government. Simple as that.